Many a times we dream big, we make big plans, we set big goals, we come up with great strategies, but fail to start that tiny step towards our ultimate goal. We let fear kill our dreams, we let fear kill our skills, our abilities, our talents, and even our passion. We let fear age us and paralyze us. What are you so afraid of anyway? Is it rejection? Is it being turned down? Is it failure? Is it things going a different direction than you expected? Is it being criticized? Is it being humiliated? Is it lack of support? Is it losing money? Is it taking risks? It's time to let go your fears. One thing I have learned about facing fears is the fact that fear is never as bad as we make it look like, as we believe. When I look at this glass, I see it as half full and not half empty. Be an optimist. Always see the bright side and the good side of everything. When you create obstacles for yourself, you are going to pass through that. And when you create a bright side, the journey might not be smooth, but you will have the courage to soldier on. Fear is never as bad as you made it look like. Overthinking can be dangerous. You can think as much as you want as to when you are going to start. But thinking is not going to change your situation. It will just keep you in the same position. For how long are you going to dream about starting your own business? How long are you going to dream about following your passion? How long are you going to dream about getting started? And how wonderful it will be when you do take action? And how much of a difference it will make to your life? Turn that dream into action. A dream without action is a fantasy destined to never come true. Perfectionism can delay your destiny. You want to start something, but you never do. You don't know when to start, how to start, where to start, where to get your motivation where to get the supplies and the finances. You think to yourself that maybe you are not good enough, that maybe you don't have the necessary skills and abilities to start. Are you ever going to keep up 
with the peace that you said. Don't worry too much. Just start with what you have and where you are and everything else will follow and fall into place. Don't wait for the perfect time or for you to be perfect. Might not be perfect the first time you do something. You might not get it all right. Mistakes will happen, but don't let them hold you back. The only person who never makes mistakes is the person who never does anything. I'm sure you don't want to be the person that does nothing. I remember this journey. I have always wanted to go for it. Ever since last year in 2021, I had made plans but never got to execute them. I kept on procrastinating and thinking that maybe that wasn't something meant for me. I thought that maybe I am not capable of it. That maybe this is something that is out of my reach. But then any time an idea comes to your mind, any time you figure out yourself doing something, it's simply because you are able and you can do it. So don't hold yourself back. Just go for it and get it done. You are not going to have everything figured out as you begin. But along the way, you are going to learn and you are going to improve and you are going to grow. Procrastination makes easy things hard and hard things harder. Start small if you must, but at least you need to start. You don't want to be that person who regrets it 20 years from now, do you? You would rather regret the things you have done than the things you did not do. A cook has all the recipes in his mind. He has all the ingredients that he needs. He even cooks in his mind, but he fails to get to the kitchen, to get the work done and the food ready. Just like that cook, even us, if we have all the ideas, all the plans, all the dreams, all the visions that we dream about and we fail to get to start, then we are never going to make anything out of it you have to wake up and get started get to that working space and get started follow your passion and dreams and you'll be surprised just how beautiful your life turns out to be stop over analyzing 
you are only wearing yourself out. You worry too much, you overthink too much, you make stuff in your head, you over exaggerate. What an imagination our brains have. baby steps let's dream plan execute achieve success step by step even Rome was not built in a day great things take time to happen one needs to be consistent and patient and put in the necessary effort to get the results don't get too comfortable get out of your comfort zone success is a very uncomfortable procedure get comfortable being uncomfortable for you to be successful <laughs>